These walleye, born and raised in the Hackettstown fish hatchery, may be making their way to a lake near you. Hatchery superintendent Craig Lemon explains the process of removing fish from the ponds they were raised in. Big line of guys and girls, we're trying to drive the walleyes down to an area where we can net them. And then we're going to surround them with a 60-foot seine and uh, try to drive them to that lower flume where we collect the seine up and hopefully we'll get a bunch of fish. The target number is 35 to 40,000 4-inch walleye that are collected, loaded on a tank truck, and stocked in designated lakes throughout the state. So what does all this hard work mean to the New Jersey angler? Well, the fish maker believes the warm water fishery has never been better and that state records are still out there waiting to be caught. You know, we fully expect to break some of these records here in the next few years on walleyes, you know, maybe muskies, maybe tiger muskies. Uh, the pike record's real high, so we probably, <laughs> probably we won't see one, but you never know. So what does the fish maker think about what he does? Yeah, you know, we've created a lot of, you know, recreational fishing opportunities for, you know, thousands and thousands of people around the state of New Jersey. You know, the biggest reward is having these people, you know, show you pictures of fish, email you pictures of fish. The most rewarding part of the job, you know, makes all this hard work and dirty, you know, worthwhile.